you are turn 7 I had met Eskil the turn before um, and this turn my fire moved from here uh, more or less from here to there to Hastberry uh, and avoided two cadavers that I met there and then I moved here killed a cadaver on the bridge and uh, moved, moved there to I think that is killed uh, should be around here, so I'm, I'm close to his trunk. But I don't know where his hero is. It looks like he's not in the north because the sites are unexplored, and um, it's probably in this area. And I'm here. Um, I managed to do a very nice fight this turn. So first I did a small small fight, and I could fight uh, three units and uh, raised one cadaver. And the elemental, of course, I couldn't qualify because it's an elemental. I didn't lose any units, um, and and it allowed me then to attack stack here uh, with uh, a nice nice items. Uh, not this one, this one. So yeah, it was four uh, elf griffin riders, riders, and one uh, high health longbowman. So it was it was a pretty hard fight uh, with probable victory, um, but I split them uh, in, in in three areas, and I used Stephen limbs to uh, to prevent them from attacking me, and then I really exploited the uh, necro abilities. But I was able only to glorify uh, two uh, eagle riders. I hope to to, to glorify more, but that's not so bad. So yeah, you see they are in circle, and, and I've got one, two uh, dread monkeys, uh, which needs to <coughs> basically draw them into a trap uh, to move. And then I use my hero to cast a different limb, uh, my leader to cast a different limb and, and slow them down. And then with my three spiders, I just uh, web them. Uh, then I use. Uh, the black bolts uh, to um, decrease their uh, increase their weakness to spirit damage and then I qualify them um, but as they are quite strong I, I I need to kill them quickly and not be overwhelmed by them and so I was not able to raise to 100% uh, spirit weakness and I, I was not able to kill them so my first red monkey got killed before I could uh, take a uh, uh, an elf rider, but the second one wasn't killed and, and drew uh, two half riders, so not so bad. Then another half rider comes here in the skeleton that I put just at hitting distance so that he attacks it and it, it is not in guard and I can uh, web him. And then the other one didn't attack my skirt, my cadaver, I don't know why. So I web him and with the second spider. I, I do Stephen Lim again with my Euro. My spider got to uh, hit it, so now she's a uh, screen, queen spider. I position my, my troops so that they cannot be hit by the eagle rider except uh, the, um, the, the, the cadavers. And then I've got still my. Uh, the Springer that I raised in some of the beginning of the game. So yeah, this longbowman is a nuisance, but I kill him next turn. Okay, the two Eagles Rider come back. I web the Griffin Rider, and he was not glorified this one. I attacked him maybe too early, but as at this point I still have five eagle riders I thought that I should do it quick. And I, as you can see I put my cadaver uh, between my leader and the eagle rider to decrease damage and uh, maximize the number of hits I can do before um, the eagle rider is dead so that I can increase the chance of uh, spirit weakness. We have it again, strike it and also here I do it more quickly because I don't have that much time before the Eagles Rider arrive. Now I take all the hits with my 
And this one I got if I, I take all the hits with my Spider Queen uh, to um, to immobilize him, but without web because I, I was still in uh, um, the cooldown. Uh, immune to go course, even though he had some uh, spirit weakness. Then I move my units back, only uh, two Eagle Riders left. And uh, so I'm trying to to web them, uh, heal my my spiders, thanks to uh, thanks to vampire vampire uh, strike. Uh, I had to use all my my spiders to web this one. Yeah, and then at the end of the fight, it's basically uh, energy drain, inflict despair, ghoul them. Raise all my units. I was able to raise to use all my my single skill uh, abilities with my hero, with my leader, so that he went to level 11 at the end of the fight. Um, so the end of the fight is pretty boring. It's just uh, maximizing hits with my hero and uh, preventing the the Griffin Rider to, to hit me. And at this point, he managed. It, it didn't. Uh, get webbed by all the spiders, so he managed to attack me once. Yeah, and so then after I, I just went to uh, with my my leader to raise everyone. So at the end of the fight, I lost only one dread monkey. And everyone else was was okay. One dread monkey. I raised the other one. Uh, goodified two. Raised one cadaver. Uh, I got another spider queen. And so I sent my two Griffin Riders east to try to find a skill then try to take a strong. Um, I hope it's not a mistake, but I think it's okay. And then next time I put a lot of sites to do here. Then another one here. Pretty nice, a dungeon, and I hope to take the dwelling. Maybe take another Deathbringer, and then let's go fight the skills. Um, also, what which what is nice is that in this fight I got 33 uh, research points, so I was able to research Badic Fearing and uh, send my my T2 cavalry into the water. Then I will take this, and I will be able to attack a skill also with him. Um, and so one level up this turn, so I'm level 11 at turn 7. Ah yeah, and I almost forgot one important thing, is to that I leveled up, so I have 8 points, and I'm taking Undying. Uh, so now I'm much safer with Undying. Um, and also, so the 3 items, I, I could have sold them, but I think that uh, the Dread Spider egg is, is is interesting, so I didn't so sell it. And then I put plus one defense, forty percent frost protection, and uh, spirit protection break control, which I already have. I oh, not. I know I didn't take break control, so that's that's nice. And uh, I think I can get gold here because, as you see, I'm not very rich. Um, in this city, I started. Uh, Harvester's Guild because I didn't take it before because I don't play Necro very well actually in uh, strategic plan because as I said before it's the first time I play Necro <coughs> and uh, yeah that's it and now I'm researching Vampiric Hunger to get life stealing on my Deathbringer because right now she doesn't have any way to heal which is not very nice okay